One car is traveling 65 miles per hour, and another car is traveling 55 miles per hour. Assuming both cars keep the same constant speed, how much faster will the car traveling 65 miles per hour travel 100 miles? And we're asked to give the time to the nearest tenth of a minute. To answer this question, we'll be using the equation distance equals rate times time, or d equals r times t. But because we're concerned about the time, we want to solve this equation for t by dividing both sides by r. So notice how this gives us the equivalent equation, time equals distance divided by rate. And now we'll determine the time it takes the car traveling 65 miles per hour to travel 100 miles. Then we'll determine the time it takes a car traveling 55 miles per hour to travel 100 miles. Then we'll determine the difference in those times. So if we let t sub 1 be equal to the time it takes the car traveling 65 miles per hour to travel 100 miles, t sub 1 would be equal to 100 miles divided by 65 miles per hour. And if we let t sub 2 be equal to the time it takes the car traveling 55 miles per hour to travel 100 miles, t sub 2 would be equal to 100 miles divided by 55 miles per hour. I'm including the units here because notice how if we take miles and divide by miles per hour, this will give us the time, but it will be in hours. So we'll find these quotients, which will give us the time in hours, but then we'll have to convert these times to minutes in order to give the final answer in minutes. So first we have 100 divided by 65. To four decimal places, this will be approximately 1.5385. And then we have 100 divided by 55, which would be approximately 1.8182. Let's go ahead and record these. So again, 1.5385 hours and 1.8182 hours. Now to convert this time to minutes, we're going to multiply by a unit fraction, meaning a fraction equal to one, that will convert the units from hours to minutes. Let's first write the time in hours as a fraction with the denominator of one. And now because we know that there are 60 minutes in one hour, and we want hours to simplify out, we're going to have hours in the denominator and minutes in the numerator. And because one hour is equal to 60 minutes, we'll have one hour in the denominator and 60 minutes in the numerator. Notice how by doing this, the units of hours simplifies out. So these products will give us the time in minutes. So going back to the calculator, 1.5385 times 60 is equal to 92.31 minutes and 1.8182 times 60 is equal to 109.092 minutes. To determine how much faster the car traveling 65 miles per hour travels 100 miles, we want to find the difference of these times. So we have 109 point zero nine two minus ninety two point three one which equals sixteen point seven eight two and of course this is still minutes and because we're asked to round to the nearest tenth we'll say the time is approximately sixteen point eight minutes so the car traveling 65 miles per hour will travel 100 miles approximately 16.8 minutes faster than a car traveling 55 miles per hour. I hope you found this helpful.